Hi, this is Jed with Math Fix, the video series that helps fix your math problems. Thanks for coming by. And again, with all math problems, I always recommend people get a pencil and paper. You'll see where you made your mistakes, and then you can correct them. Uh, today, we're going to talk about number lines, and I'm going to give you a couple of tricks. But specifically, we're going to be minusing in these ones. We're going to be subtracting. So again, when you're adding on number lines, you go to the right. And when you're subtracting, you go to the left. And I always urge people to use the semicircles and arrow method, and it helps to keep you track where you are. So 3 minus 5, how do we do this on a number line? Well, let's start at 3, and we're going to take away 5. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 semicircles. And put a little arrow. You're going to be needing that in physics, physics classes one day. So 3 minus 5, and we're going to draw a big semicircle with an arrow. And so that leaves you with minus 2. The second question, here's a little, now here's a little bit of a problem. We've got minus 5 minus 2. So again, we're going to go 1, 2, 3, 4, minus 5. But now we have to minus 2. So that gets you even further down here to minus 7. So again, we're going to do a whole semicircle to minus 7. I hope that makes sense. Now the third one, a little bit more tricky. Now we're going to do minus 5, minus, in brackets, minus 2. Now you've probably you've heard of this rule where you've got two minuses together. That means you flip the signs. So now they both become positive. Okay, so now again, try not to get confused with this, but now that they're both positive, now you get to go to the right. So here's where the arrows that I've been drawing really come in handy. So minus 5, well, how do we do that? Minus 5. We go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So we've got minus 5 on here. But now we have to add 2. Adding 2, that means we go to the right. So we add 2. We're going to draw bigger semicircles. Now we add 2. So our answer now is minus 3. I hope that makes sense. And there's plenty of other problems you can do. These are really great problems to understand because they, they come up a lot in life. Thank you for stopping by. Please subscribe to my channel. Have a great day.